going to show you how to make spicy tuna roll. I have here bamboo mat wrapped in a saran wraps and half sushi nori. And I'm going to wet my hand first. And this is a sushi rice. We already cooked and seasoned and cooled. We're going to put in there on the seaweed and spread onto seaweed. You want to cover seaweed with rice all over, no, um, no peaking. And then you don't want to be too thick layer of the rice, kind of one layer of the rice. And then you want to be even, spread evenly. And then many times people do is you just cover the seaweed with rice on the center part of it, just the center, and it, that's not gonna work. You wanna cover with the side, top, and the bottom also. Then here I have sesame seed, just sprinkle. Okay. This is gonna be inside the out roll, so I'm gonna flip over. Now, I have tuna. So you wanna fill the tuna in the center of the seaweed, about total like half inch square, and all the way end to end. Now, if you wanna put the uh, spicy sauce here, you can put it now. But I don't do too much inside because when you roll, it's gonna get like woozy out. So just a little bit here, then now I'm gonna roll. Pick up your bamboo with your thumb and then with the other fingers, hold ingredients and then let the wet coming in here and then make it tighter. Pick up, roll and a shape. Okay. So that's your sushi roll. I'm trying to make the shape of the roll kind of square. De how you, depends on how you want it to be. Some chef want to be like a little round on the top and a uh, square on the side. It's up to you. Um, but the only thing you don't want to do is flat sushi. So now I'm going to cut the roll. Wet your knife with damp towels. And I'm going to cut the roll in half first. Hold the roll on the side with your hand and let the knife go and cut it quickly. And if you get the little gooey stuff, you want to clean it up. Otherwise it's going to get the, um, sticky. And come in here. And cut in half again. Cut the half again. And cut the half again. So here I have plates. What else you can do is you can add more spicy sauce on the top. That's how you make your spicy tuna roll.